Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel Biotechy. In this today video, we are going to see about some basic facts regarding virus. There are many microorganisms around us which we cannot able to see through our naked eye, but through the microscope. Hence why they called it as microorganisms. When we used to think about microorganisms, some types like bacteria, virus and mostly fungi will appear in our mind. In this today video, we are going to see about the profile of virus. Virus has another one name called biological puzzle because still scientists can't able to prove that whether it is a living or non-living thing. And it is 10,000 times smaller than bacteria, hence it can take bacteria as the host and get entered into any living body and cause ailments to plants, animals and human beings. In this, the virus is either living or non-living thing. When they are out of the host cell, they are non-living thing and in crystalline form. But once they enter into the host cell, they become living thing. By acquiring the DNA of that same host in this way, it can reproduce inside the host cell and start to spread the ailments. These viruses are mostly found in everywhere like in deserts, polar regions, temperate regions, marshy lands, etc. Not only the virus but all microorganisms are present in everywhere but they are inactive due to unfavorable condition. But when once they acquire the favorable condition, it's hoped to activate activation and start their impact either that is good or bad. When the viruses are in active condition, they respond to heat, radiations and chemicals. And when they are not non-living mode, they can be crystallized and stored it for a very long time like other non-living things. Viruses consist of either DNA or RNA that surrounds by the protein coat and in some virus this protein coat is enveloped by the another coverings. This envelope has spikes that helps the virus particle to attach to the host cells.